Hi Virgo, it's Elle here to do your 72 hour energy reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It is much appreciated. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. So let's go ahead and jump into this Virgo. Okay, so um, yeah, let's go ahead and pray. Thank you, Lord, God, for blessing the Virgo with a true and accurate message from you. Um, so we're going to start our reading with a quote. And the quote reads, like the people who like you. Okay, so it's so much easier when you just like people who like you. When you're chasing and seeking validation from people who clearly don't like you in that way, it's all it's an uphill battle. It is a chase. They're fleeting. They're running away from you. You're chasing behind them you're chasing their validation it's so much easier when you like the people who like you i know it's so simple but it's it, that a uh, quote brings a lot you know um, packs a lot of power if you really dissect it okay and off camera what i got for you is bird's eye view i don't know what that means for you um Virgo, but it might mean something for you with this high priestess coming out. Like, maybe you already know something um, because you kind of got, like, that spiritual download or you can feel it. You got that women's intuition going on with you. Even if you are a man, you, you, your intuition is kicking in and something is um, speaking to you. Or maybe about a new career, and it could be a new career in, in writing something that you want to do you want to start something new maybe even a new business a new business venture you want to put your energy effort time into something else you're feeling like your stability is elsewhere with the page of pentacles coming up but it says that you may be doing too much talking wishful thinking and not enough action um there might be even a level of pro procrastination here so they want you to get um committed um, get active and do what it is you need to do to see your dreams realized. Also, some of you know that um, somebody's keeping something from you, and it might even be another relationship um, that this person travels to this person's home or they they come to their home. Um, this person, whomever you're, you're pining after, you're wanting, you're holding on to their every word, and you're holding on to hope also, and they may even be creating hope to you know with their words and. Um, trying to hold you, trying to keep you in a place of holding on. Um, this person could be engaging in like an only sex, or, you know, maybe a non-committal relationship with someone else. They could be giving you the commitment, um, but they're stagnating your your relationship. They're putting it at a halt, or they're putting a cap on how far you guys can go with the Four of Pentacles, because this person is keeping you outside of their home. And a lot of times home can be interchanged with heart. So they're keeping you outside of their heart space. There's a lack of intimacy here. This person is dominating and domineering. This person wants to exert their will, their force on you. They want you to take to what they want to do in this relationship and just deal with it. They want to keep the status quo up. Whatever the status quo was or is, that's what they want it to be. They want to lock the relationship right here at the Four of Pentacles. You could even live on the outskirts of town and they come and visit you or like something about keeping you outside of their home or something's outside of the home. Something is sexual, just only sexual in nature um, between this person maybe and you or this other person that they're dealing with. Uh, there's a wealthy man here who's concerned about, well, who's concerned about his wealth. Um, and he could be very official too. Um, or then you need to go speak with an official about maybe starting something, even starting the proceedings to something. I don't know what that is about. Um, because there is another woman here. Um, the main female card is the other woman, especially to the wealthy man. She is not his counterpart. She is not his uh, wife or girlfriend. The privileged lady is his wife and or girlfriend so we have another woman here um something could be arriving to you or you could be uh hosting guests in your home uh would you have a holiday coming up um you could get some some knowledge from somebody in your home something is arriving and something is leaving or vice versa somebody's keep trying to keep you stuck in your thoughts um also trying to keep you 
stuck. Yeah, trying to keep you stuck in your thoughts. But it looks like spirit wants you to walk through this portal that they're trying to open up for you in terms of maybe the bird's eye view. You need to see it, this situation from all angles. The bird's eye view can see everything, okay? Because that was the message that I got when I was meditating. Some of you are going to need to go to court. Wow, and as I say that, the courthouse card shows up. Judication in court. It will be between man and woman. You're going to have to file some legal documents. It, like I said, some proceedings here. Um, this is interesting. And maybe somebody is keeping you on the strings or, or on their string. Excuse me. Keeping you hooked or on their string because they don't want you to file documentation or vice versa. This is you, Virgo. You don't want someone to file documents. So you're keeping them. You're saying whatever you need to say to keep them pacified. Okay, but you have you're not taking any real action. This is an interesting dynamic. If you wanted to be with somebody right now, this the card say this specific person that you're thinking about, it's gonna be a lot of work, a lot of hard work for you guys to stay together or either come together. Okay. The cards want you to focus on your new career and it can have something to do with writing, reporting, um, staying at home, working from home. Um, start that business. Okay, focus on that. Focus on things that will fulfill you um, and keep your mind occupied. So Virgo, this is your reading. I hope that um, you took something from the reading. If you did, go over to the website, book your own reading there. Take advantage of the text question where you can text the question to the number below. You can also donate to the channel if you're feeling moved to do so. Thank you, Virgo. Many blessings to you.